Last time on Dragon Ball Z Kai, Goku l e a r n That's not her voice. Shut up. You're the reason I'm mad in the first place. Oh, why is that? You know very well. You stole my kill. And you know that Blastone is rightfully mine. Oh, <gasps> what should we do? I don't know. Wanna argue with him? Play on his pride? Boy, you can't talk to me like that. I know how computers work. I'm just asking. You to see if you can get the internet working again. Is that too much to ask? <sighs> you know what? Yes. Yes, it is. Because it's not my network, okay? Um. What's up? Shiro hands me a folded sheet of notebook paper. What is this? It's my email address. Yes! We should stay in touch. Ah,、oh, good idea. As I turn the corner, I nearly collide with another student. But I quickly skid to a halt and wind my way around him. Sorry! This month the school is offering an after school work program for students who want to make extra money. It's only menial tasks like mailing envelopes or calling people to ask for donations. But I could always use the spare cash. Dude. Even though I get allowance on the weekend, more money could be hurt. However, the work program doesn't start for another 30 minutes, so now is the perfect time to check on how Rui is doing. I wait impatiently outside the computer lab as students file out. Finally, I rush in and grab the nearest computer. I wonder if the internet's working again. Worried about your game? Travis is standing in the doorway smirking at me. Why do you care? I don't. You just look terribly anxious. I was wondering if you had something to do with that game of yours. Hmm. <laughs> well, I don't feel like telling you. And by the way, I figured out that answer to the riddle of yours. No doubt. It's, fairly a common, it's a fairly common one. After all, I was a bit disappointed that you hadn't heard it already. But I'm no deal breaker. The internet works now, so you can have fun. Did you fix it? No, I just waited, and it came back on its own. Sorry, guys, my camera cut out for a second. I. My fault. I left the timer on by accident. But, anyway. So, he did not fix it. It just came back on its own. So, here we are. So, you didn't hold up the end of your bargain. Neither did you, I assume. Or are you telling me that someone else didn't tell you the answer to my riddle? Shiroku. I thought so. See you around. Ugh, what a conceited jerk. I hope he gets his someday. <gasps> do, 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 do. Mom! Trade in 50 fluff a bit paws for a piece of lucky armor. <laughs> fluff a bit. Fluff a bit paws. Read this sword is locked on. Game announcement. The PvP match you participated in with player Alistair has been cancelled due to inactivity from both parties. Really? Are you okay? What happened? Hey, Fiona. My internet connection dropped. I just got back on. I was so worried about you. Cry face. Sorry. So, if your connection dropped, does that mean you automatically forfeited to Alistair? Um, it doesn't look like it. Apparently, he didn't do anything. Maybe he didn't want such an easy win. Mom! I don't think so. If he was willing to steal or kill, he'd definitely accept an auto forfeit. Oh, then maybe he logged off. Maybe. It seems weird that we'd both drop at the same time. <gasps> Unless. Maybe you just got lucky. Hmm. What's wrong? Just thinking. H- how do you even do that face? Like. What if his connection dropped at the same time? Because we're both on the same network! I, I don't understand. What don't you understand? Mom! I lost my connection because my internet died. 
What if Alistair was using the same internet connection as me? Uh, um, I guess that's a possibility. Where are you? At school. The school's net went down for a while, so he would have been logged off like me. Wait, you think... Alistair goes to the same school as you? Yeah, it all makes sense. People can lose internet connections for all sorts of reasons. What if his mom told him it was time to go to bed or something? Dude, if she's at school, and she's not at school, and he's asleep, where are we? No, it's too much of a coincidence. It has to be someone at this school. If you say so, but I think that's a stretch. Well, I think your cleric status is a stretch. I don't know. No, it's perfect. That means I'll be able to exact my revenge in real life. Danganronpa. <laughs> um, how do you plan to do that? What? If you do manage to find him, what exactly are you going to do? It's not as if you can just challenge him to a duel in real life. Uh, well, I guess I'll figure that out later. But the important part is... REVENGE! Are you sure about that? Is this like... Female Berserk? Is that... Griffith? Or Guts? And then that's like... Casca, and she's like, dude, chill. And Alistair is like, totally Griffith, except they weren't friends. That guy deserves to pay for what he did. It's only an item in a game, though. Mom. The voice of reason. It's not about that item. It's about being courteous online. Remember your netiquette, kids. I think that's a lot to ask for people on the internet. <laughs> Please, don't bully me. <laughs> hmm. Well, just because it's the internet doesn't mean we should give up standards of decency. I guess so. But you really shouldn't jump to conclusions, okay? You might do something brash. When have I ever done anything brash? When have I ever... Shh. Never mind. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to make sure Ruby wasn't dead. I've got to get going now. Why would she be dead? Uh, I guess you'd like start in a start town, but you just spawned. I don't understand. Uh, um, I'll see you. Mm? Like, like Daedra? Mm. Sorry. Later. Ruby the sword is locked off. See you again. I lock off Rivenel online and quickly bring up my school's network list. The name of Trust and Honesty. Oh, in the name of Trust and Honesty, the school keeps close tabs on all the students' computers usage. I don't know how much trust it shows, but it's really handy for seeing who's on the network and when. Looking at this afternoon's logs, only four students were logged on when the internet dropped. Naturally, I'm one of them. Shiro was on too. Huh. He didn't seem like a gamer, though. He was probably just checking his email. Bum bum bum! Some guy named Derek Naveen. Naveen. Adam Levine. <laughs> his name sounds familiar, but where have I heard it before? And... Travis! Ugh, of course he was online. He was sitting in the computer, typing away. You said that. Y you said that. I wouldn't be too surprised if he was Alistair. They both have rotten personalities. But Travis didn't seem too interested in Rhythm Online. In fact, he said it was a silly game. Maybe he doesn't play it after all. I guess that leaves Derek. I click on his student profile. Apparently he's on the student council. I guess that's where I've heard his name before. He's on the basketball team as well. They're practicing right now, so he's probably there. I hurry down the hallway and stop outside the school gym. I can hear shouts of the echoing boom of a basketball. Slowly I crack the door open and peer in. Dude. Nice. The basketball players are rushing back and forth across the court. The current center of attention seems to be a guy with blonde hair and bright highlights. It's a singular highlight. 
He races across the court, expertly dribbling the ball as he weaves back and forth. I remember seeing posters of him all over the school during elections. I guess he's Derek then. He looks like he really knows what he's doing. Another player leaps in front of him, holding his arms out to block him. Derek pauses for a moment, then grins playfully at him and fakes left before making a dash to them. Just like... <laughs> Kuroko. He skids to a halt in front of the basket as another player moves in to block him. Derek, over here! Student. One of his teammates waves his arms to indicate that he's open, but Derek shakes his head. He's one of those. And weaves around the player blocking him. To the cheers of his teammates, he leaps into the air and dunks the ball into the net. That's enough showing off, Naveen. Take a water break. Oh, he's grinning. A couple guys surround Derek, clapping him on the back and laughing. One of them leans towards him and points in my direction. Oops. I slam the door shut, but not fast enough. In a few seconds, the door opens and Derek steps out into the hallway. Hey, cutie. Did you want something? Should I give him, like, a jock voice? Like, hey, cutie. Did you want something? Oh, no, I don't know. I can't do a jock voice. C cutie Oh, was that too forward? He bursts out laughing. Ha, huh, I'm sorry. I'm just a forward kind of guy. It gets me in a lot of trouble sometimes. Especially with cute girls. Dude, you're on the student council. You're supposed to be all like... Like that guy from Danganronpa, the Ishimaru. Like, yes, sir! Like, I don't know. You're not student council material, kid. Sorry. Something wrong? Don't be shy. I'm a really nice guy, you know. You can come in and watch us practice if you want. I it's not bad. Oh, so you do speak. That's great. So, what's your name? Nerui. Sweet. I like girls with unique names. He nods back at the gym door. I'd love to stay in chat. The coach probably wants to be back with you. Is there something you wanted? I just had a few questions. Nothing important. Hey, I'm vice president. Anything from the student... <sighs> Anything from the member of the student body is important. <laughs> it's not exactly about school, though. Oh, that's even more interesting. Why don't we talk about it at the mall? We could call it a date if you want. Is this guy actually asking me out on a date? He hardly even knows me. I guess he is kind of cute, though. But look, he's got the little smile and the pretty eyes and the highlight. The highlight's cool, man. No, focus. What if he is Alistair? I'd never be able to forgive myself if I went on a date with him. He took a rock from a game. He's so cute. <laughs> what should I do? Hmm. Ask for just a friendly chat. Nah, man, we're going on a date. Well, I guess a date doesn't sound like a bad idea. Cool. We'll work out the details later. Your email address is in the student directory, right? Um, yeah. Then we'll be in touch. He winks at me before I heading back into the gym. Catch you later. Hey, Ruby. Aww. Oi, I didn't get to ask him what I wanted. Oh, well. At least we'll be able to talk later. For now, I should probably get to work. I spend the next hour folding and sealing envelopes in the school's office. It's not exactly the most glamorous job in the world, but money is money, and I can't complain about that. After the office closes, I head home. As soon as I get home, I turn my computer on and check my email. <gasps> a boy. Items, items. Hey, River Willers. It's a new month, and you all know what that means. New rare items. Look, cool and you gain extra ice damage with the Winter Frost Blade for knights. Demons will find the Horned Helm to be a fine addition in their arsenal. The Glorious Halo will give extra healing powers to angels. Guardians should pick up some volcanic armor for extra fire defense. These items will only be available for a month, so go buy a point card and get yours now. Nerun. There isn't much about Athens on the internet. 
So I've had a couple of useful books that I think would be useful. Sorry. If you find any more, you should get them. It would also be a good idea if we could meet up sometime to discuss over a project. You should come over to my place sometime so we can talk about it more. Hmm. Hmm. Where are we gonna buy a book? I search for information about Athens Online, but there really isn't much. How? How? <laughs> some of the history, some mythology, and a bit of info on the culture, but nothing very deep. Okay, yeah. Joe's right. I'll actually have to get some books or something, huh? Encyclopedia. I copy and paste a few interesting facts, but my attention wanders around pretty quickly. I'm still thinking about what happened today. Fine. If I can't concentrate on this, I might as well just log on. Maybe hacking away at monsters will help calm me down. Said every Final Fantasy player ever. You know, because you have to like grind for that XP. It's rough. Rui the sword is locked on. Hi, Rui! Hey, Fiona. How's it going? I'm doing well. Taking a break, need you? <laughs> I'm procrastinating on some of my homework. Uh, are, are you sure that's a good idea? Yes, Mom. I'm fine. Besides, I need to blow up some steam. Want to be in a party with me for a while? Sure. Fiona Wings has joined your team. Where should we go? Well... I think there's a promotion going on in the Morose Mountains right now. Then let's get going. Hey, Bay. Well, well, if it isn't the lovely Rui, come for the promotion, I assume. Ah, oh, look at my little, oh, his little thing. Ugh, what are you doing here? Oh, she's an angel, he's a demon, and she's a guardian, I think. Cause, I mean, I guess that armor class. Cause that's some pretty heavy armor for just a knight. Killing adorable bunny-like creatures until the game awards me with a new costume. What does it look like? You know what I mean. Hmm, not really. Really? Let's just go. The mountains are big enough for us to stay far away from the sky. You should listen to your friend. She's clearly more forward-thinking than you are. Are you calling me stupid? What do you think? <laughs> nice. Well... For your information, I'm not as stupid as I look. Really? In fact, I already know who you are in real life. What? Ha! Are you scared now? And you can be sure that when I see you at school tomorrow, you'll get yours. At school? <laughs> I see. The internet crashed during lunch, right? So you must be Mei Rui. I mean, it says Rui in her name, and her name's my Rui. Internet crash, school. It's... Come on, Rui the sword. May Rui? It's pretty obvious. Thank you. And since we only met today, your name is still fresh in my mind. But it's only fair, right? Since you know who I am, after all. Of course I do! No, you don't. If you did, you would have done something by now. You still haven't figured it out exactly. I, I will. Hmm, sounds like this might be fun. What? Let's make a deal. If you can figure out who I am sometime in the next month, I'll give you my blessed stone. You mean my blessed stone? Whatever suits your fancy. But if you can't figure it out, then you'll have to fork over all the gold that you make for the rest of the month. I mean, have you ever played World of Warcraft? You have to farm that stuff. Stop. <laughs> As if I accept your deal. Don't. Mom, it's too late. Ah, uh, such confidence. At least you have that much going for you. Oh, but it's getting so late. Don't you think? I'll see you tomorrow, Rui. Alistair is locked off. Really? I heard you do that. Ugh, that guy seriously ticks me off. And I'm not going to just let him get away with being a jerk online. Jerk art online. But what if you lose? Don't worry. I won't. 
At the most, I know there were only three other people online. I just have to figure out which one of them plays Ribbon well. Really, you really do leap into things without thinking, you know? Huh, that's why I have you to back me up. I could always count on you to bail me out of a bad situation. Dude, don't treat your friends like that. Come on, man. I wish you'd be a little more careful on your own, though. I won't always be around to save you. Hey, that's enough of this glum talk. Let's kill some bunnies. Yeah! Fiona and I play for a few hours before exchanging farewells and logging off. Oh my god. Is that Magnet? It's, it's book like Magnet, but they're like bald dudes. I want to say that's Dio, but I'm probably wrong. Someone tell me what it is. And I think that's how to a full boyfriend. You know, like, the pigeon boy and everything. As I get ready for bed, I think back on today's events. Only Travis, Shiro, and Derek were online, so it must be one of them. Travis seems to hate Riverwall. He acts like it's beneath him because he's a serious gamer. But he might just be trying to save face in front of the other serious gamers. He has his position in club president, after all. Shiro doesn't seem like a gamer at all. Besides, he's so shy. I doubt he and Alistair are the same person. Usually if you're shy in real life, you can be bold on the internet. Like, here I am. I don't talk much, no, never mind. Then again, some of the nicest people turn into rotten jerks online. Hey! Playing online might be his way of blowing off steam or something. As for Derek, I really don't know anything about him, yet besides the fact that he's the school vice president. What does the vice president even do anyway? Well, this doesn't really matter in the end. I'll figure out which one it is tomorrow anyway. <gasps> it's Monday. I have five intelligence and fifty dollars. Wow, that's more than I have. 